Yo, so a girl could be with a guy and he's got it. He's got money, nice flashy car, he's got a yard, he's, he's loaded, he's making money, good job, whatever. A man could lose that and then all of a sudden his woman disappears. Now, a lot of people will say, oh, she was just with him for the money, for the lifestyle, for the car, whatever. She was with him for the security. And now that it's not there, she's up sticks and left. Oh, she a gold digger. No, not necessarily. One thing people need to remember is that women are attracted to strength and confidence in men. And most men, their confidence and their strength comes from how much money they got. You know, what car they drive in, what job they're working at. So a man, a lot of men, when they lose that, they lose their confidence. Then they become weak. There's a certain man, they might lose their job. Certain man might not be earning the same amount of money no more. And they become weak. They start panicking. Oh, how am I going to pay these bills? How am I going to do so? How am I going to do that? I might lose my car. They lose confidence to become weak. And to a woman that is very unattractive. Women do not like unconfident, weak men. Certain women will leave because of that. A lot of women will leave because of that. And people looking in from the outside will say, Oh, um, she's just a gold digger. No, 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 no. She ain't no gold digger. She went with him just for his money. Yeah, the lifestyle and the money attracted him to her. Sorry, her to him. But it was the energy that, you know, he displayed. It's the way he carried himself. That confidence that kept them together. And now that the confidence has gone and it's been replaced with weakness... She's disappeared on him. A lot of people don't know this. A lot of people think that, oh, women out here are gold diggers. No, no. Yeah, there are some women that are just with men just for their money. But a lot of women ain't. A lot of women are with men for the way that the man makes the woman feel. Like I had to mention to the man, I've been with my girl, yeah, you know, a little while now, whatever, lost my job. Let's say the beginning of February. It's the end of November right now. I ain't worked. Yep, it's the end of uh, October, sorry. It's the beginning of November right now, basically. I ain't worked in that period of time. She ain't gone nowhere. Because I maintain my confidence. Maintain my strength as a man. That's what keeps a woman around. If when I lost my job or whatever, oh, why am I going to pay my bills? Start panicking. She would have been gone. Telling you. Now, obviously, if a man loses his job and that, yeah, don't get it twisted, yeah. You can't be a bum living on your mum's sofa for the next 10 years, yeah. You have to be seen to be trying to get back your things and that. But you've got a decent amount of time. She ain't going to leave you after a week or a month or three months. But if this is a prolonged thing, yeah, yeah, yeah. You can ma maintain your strength all you want, yeah. But if you don't get back to that, that stage that you was at, or you ain't striving to get back to that stage that you was at, yeah, she's gonna leave you. She's gonna leave you. She, you know, she, you know, no girl wants to be with a broke bum, especially if he was, you know, he had it before. And this weakness thing, this is, a, a, I can't stress it enough. It's a serious thing. This is why the relationships break. Like, this is why man them lose women and they don't understand why weakness. A man said to me, oh, you know, if if you was with a ting for five years and you built up a lot, you invested a lot, wouldn't you ball over the ting? Now, balling means basically crying, yeah? Wouldn't you cry over the ting? Now, you know, I would, he, he, said to, he said to me, oh, I would cry over a relationship of, uh, that's been going on for five years, that's ended or whatever. But if a girl catches a man crying, that's it. I told him, final nail in the coffin. Don't do that, fam. Don't do that, blood. No, don't do that, fam. Like, weakness is... Weakness to a woman, yes. So, when a man displays weakness to a woman, that's the equivalent of a girl that was like a supermodel 
becoming fat and overweight and unattractive. That's that's what it is. It's the same thing. And this is why, and I know lots of people won't agree with me, and that's cool. This is why certain men are not allowed to see their children. It's wrong of the women. Yeah, it's wrong of the women. But there's certain men, they start acting weak around their children. Start crying, begging, please let me see my children, banging down the door. Acting desperate. And women will play piggy in the middle with your kid. Oh, I'm not going to let you see your kid now. There's certain women out here, they got man around or their baby dads. They don't give a fuck about their children. She begs him to come and see the kid. But the man that wants to see his kid, she plays around with him and doesn't let him see the child. Now, I'm not saying the woman's right for it. I'm just saying it is facts is fact. This is how it goes sometimes. Not all women, don't get it twisted. But this is how it goes sometimes. But the reason why I believe certain men are not allowed to see their children is because they're displaying weakness. If a man went about it a different way, if he was to able if he was able to control his emotions, even if he loves his kids, even if he was able even if he loves his kid, so long as he's able to control his emotion, that woman would allow him to see his child or children or whatever. So guys, do not be crying over no girls. Even if, yeah, when I say you don't cry over no girls, this don't mean in her presence. I mean, don't cry over no girls, period. Don't cry over no girls, period. Come on, fam. Come on, blood. But yeah, I get it, obviously, man, you know, man invest in this and that, but Nah, man. If a man show, if you show weakness to a girl, especially if she sees that, yeah, like that's 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 the final nail in the coffin. Right, I'm gonna give you stay wise with my left hand this time, cause I've got my camera held in my right hand. Stay wise.